Yeah, at least I have more energy now. It it's the eh handbook. Oh, here are your murder rules. Uh, welcome back to rule number five. <laughs> <laughs> Once a murder takes place, a class trial will begin shortly th uh, thereafter. Mm, at least it wasn't rule 34. Uh, participation is mandatory for all surviving students. Oh, don't worry, Ashley. There's plenty of that. I know so if the blackened is. is exposed during the class trial, they alone will be executed. If the blackened is not exposed, the remaining student will be basically the same shit from Dog and Rumble 1. Same shit. As a reward, the surviving Blacken will be forgiven of their crime and allowed to leave the island. The body discovery announcement will play as soon as there are three or more people discover a body. F whatever. I know this shit. Destroying any property in this island with permission is supposed to be ever the surveillance camera. Really blah. You're free to investigate the island at your own. Did you find it? Got it. Additional school. Re ah. Okay. Okay. We get it. I like how it's just called last rule. As I raised my head from the e handbook with a heavy sigh. <gasps> Heavy sigh. <laughs> okay. I saw the dark con <laughs> courtyard of the hotel. I sat on the beach, paralyzed Bitch. with thought. Oh, I thought I said beach. <laughs> Is he really going to make us do this? There was no way I could believe this was now my reality. Even so, this was undeniably real. Oh, yeah, Gundams. I forgot. Yeah. Uh, no matter how no Gundams. Okay, no matter fine. no matter how much I didn't want to believe it, the moment I experienced it. And experienced and felt it for myself. God. Jesus, maybe we shouldn't record this right now. <laughs> it, be, it became undeniably real. So real. This is a reality that could not be more dif different. Wow. wow. <laughs> what could not be more different <laughs> from my usual daily Are you life? Okay. <laughs> school, studying, exams, job hunting, going for walks, going to school, riding the train, lectures, shitting my pants. Not that kind of daily life is no longer mine. Having a stroke because he can't read. <laughs> I guess. As I looked up, I saw stars glimmering in the night, covering the sky like a sheet. They looked as if they were about to fall on my hands like fluttering snow, mm -hmm. and then they fell into my hands like fluttering snow. Like fucking balls of Turns fire. out it was snow. <laughs> For the first time since I arrived on this island, instead of the night sky I'd grown accustomed to, I saw a night sky that was far too beautiful. As I stared blankly into that night sky, I suddenly imagined those words in my mind. The student who murders their classmate will be able to leave this island. Woo! And when we were forced to hear these words, we just stood there. Menacingly! <laughs> Nobody said a word. And eventually, everyone scattered and vanished. It's skitter, skitter, skitter. <laughs> and it led straight to the... F it, it, wow. And it led straight mm -hmm. on to the first night. A night so beautiful it enchanted me. And yet my heart was horribly upset. That kind of beauty was definitely far f different than my usual daily life. This is my favorite theme in the whole game. Or... Was chapped was one. <laughs> My lips are chapped. <laughs> My lips are chapped. <laughs> Just so in destination despair, daily life. Oh shit, the ding dong bing bong is it's coming. Back. Welcome okay. back, Monica. Ahem! Hope's Peak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. It is now 10 p.m. Nighttime can be confusing. If you're out at night and accidentally meet a killer, then it sucks to be you. But if you're worried about that and can't sleep, I've prepared a cottage on the hotel grounds for each of you. Every single one of you, please feel free to rest in your own rooms. However, before you go to bed, I strongly recommend you lock your doors. You never know who might be planning to kill you. <laughs> bye bye. Did you start a timer? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Damn, that's ominous. That's ominous. That ticking timer. A cottage, huh? Time to go to the cottage. Uh, oh, remember you have a map that tells you where each person's cottage is too. Cottage. Oh, I can cottage cheese. Cottage. <laughs> cottage. Cottage. Where's Cheers. my cottage? That's Chiaki's cottage. That's not mine. That's You're on the girl's side. The That's not me. This is Wait, the girl's hey. side. That's not me. That's not me either. <laughs> it's almost as if these are all girls. Yeah, weird. You grill. Wow, what? Well, that's weird. Well, I that's guess, weird, you grill. I guess I don't have a cottage then. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> hey, um, that looks dumb enough to be me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, with the fucking antenna pointing out yeah. your head. Yeah, fucking alfalfa-ass hair. Alfalfa. Oh, this is a nicer room yeah, than before. It's a Definitely not going to be where the first murder takes place again. Damn it. As soon as I entered the cottage, I collapsed on the bed. Me. I tripped. <laughs> what the hell? As I screamed silently to myself, I buried my head in my arms. I didn't want to see anyone anymore. I just wanted to be alone forever. 
I have nobody I can trust. The literal opposite. Because I, even if I wanted to trust them, I don't know anything about them yet. The only person I can trust is myself. Not even... No, even I don't believe... Wow, I fuck... I really can't read right now. In truth, after I was forced to hear that dumb rule, you can't leave unless you kill someone, I realize there's a part of me that really wants to get off this island. A part of me that really wants to kill. I'm the murderer. <laughs> and at that moment, I let out a scream. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm upset. <laughs> <laughs> a scream erupted from my mouth. <laughs> it rushed from my mouth like water from a collapsed dam. <laughs> Why me? Why do I have to go through with this? Ah. <laughs> I began to lose my voice as it faded entirely. <laughs> no, not complete silence. I heard the faint sound of crashing waves in the distance. No, <laughs> <laughs> no man down! <laughs> I don't know if those are waves. I don't know why the yeah, waves they were crashing, were, all right. I don't know why the waves were crashing like that. I don't think there was anybody piloting the waves. As if the waves were murmuring into my ears. This is no longer the world you knew. And once again, I buried my head in my arms. Why am I here? What am I doing here? What is my purpose in life? I forced my eyes shut. Force close my eyes. I'm a Jedi. I wasn't tired or anything, but I just wanted to sleep. If only for a short while. I wanted to put an end to it all, so I oh. killed <laughs> yeah, it was And if by chance I managed to wake up the next day, it would be awesome if I was back to my normal life. <laughs> With these meager expectations, I fell into a light sleep. Yay! Hey, guess what? It's my favorite part of the game. Wait, hang on. A light sleep, like... Yeah, not a heavy one. There we go. Just, just sleep. a very just, just, light sleep. As opposed to a dark sleep. Just a very light... No, a heavy. There we go. That was me falling into light sleep. Fall right into that light sleep. Hey! God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Shit. <laughs> to those of you who purchased Duncan Rapa 2, goodbye despair. To which I did not. Thank you very much. To those of you who are borrowing Duncan Rapa 2, <laughs> goodbye despair from a friend. You always list, risk losing friends when you borrow their things, so you should buy your own copy just to be safe. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty sound logic. Well then, it's been a while since the main story started, so I'll give you the keynote address right now. Actually, that's really helpful, because we haven't played this in like a week. From now on, I promise you'll be charmed by this world. It genuinely deserves to be called a true game. Uh -huh. So, make sure you get excited and immerse yourself in the heart-throbbing action to your heart's content. Now then, until the very end, please enjoy this game to the fullest. Thanks, Monica. That is so nice of you. Sure. Bastard. Bang! Bong! It's foreshadowing because he's going to rip your heart out. <laughs> All right. Ahem! Hope's Peak Academy's school trip executive committee has an announcement to make. Good morning, everyone! Looks like today is going to be another perfect tropical day! Now then, let's show some enthusiasm and make sure to give it our all today! <sighs> so, it definitely wasn't a dream after all. See so you go with the emo boy. <laughs> I was forced to acknowledge that yet again, which put me in a bad mood from the get-go. I guess for now, I should go outside. Oh. No, 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 you're not allowed to go out. Fuck you. But Monokuma, why are you here? I almost went into Makoto voice. Oh. Hey now, don't be so worried. I'm here for fun reasons. Well, I don't like that. Fun reasons? I want you to find my stuffed animals. I got ahead of myself and made too many. But I thought it'd be a waste to just throw them away, so I've hidden them all over the island. They're scattered all over various areas, so you just go right ahead and look for them all. Why do I have to do something like that? Because I said so! You can't say no! No! You can't say no! <laughs> no! You can't say no! No! You can't say 
<laughs> just like, goes on. It's like, for it's the like rest a Persona the Five, where they're like, "Do you have any other ideas?" It's like, "Well, you just repeat the same idea." Ah, no, that'll never work. Do you have any other ideas? Or when I'm opening a door and it's like, "Oh, did you do that? You better not." You're just like, "Damn it, damn it!" I only do it when you're around. Damn. Yeah, you do. <laughs> I've already hidden one of them in this room, and I won't let you out till you find it. Good luck. It's really obvious. Damn it, that selfish stuffed animal. Hmm. Where could it be? <laughs> Who fucking knows? Who knows? Shit, man. Oh, we'll man, never I can't find it. I don't know. See. I don't know where it is. What's interactable? Uh, I could check under the bed. They're actually not interactable. This bed, it's pretty comfortable. Oh shit. Oh, where, fuck. where else could it be? Is it outside? Outside. This room has a lot of windows. They probably want to feel tropical and open. Well, this isn't really the time to be grateful for that. Okay, and then there's so a this question is a, mark. The mo what this is teaching you is this is what replaces regular Monokuma tokens being hidden in objects. Oh, okay. What is this? It looks like a shelf. I feel like I shouldn't put anything here. Okay, so that means shit's gonna be put there later. Damn, I can't find this thing at all. How did you put your cursor right over it? I feel like it should be right there, but I don't see anything. Lord have mercy on your fucking soul. I hope you go to heaven because there are no the bathroom. to hell. There's a room for showering beyond this point. It's pretty large. It looks easy to use, but I never feel comfortable showering. What? Well, this is... Well, it's this kind of situation after all. You're not comfortable... What? Is it because of your hair? Uh, no, I think it's because uh, sometimes people die in showers. You know, you got a point Yeah, there. you know, historically in yeah. Rampa games. <laughs> Wherever I go, there are surveillance cameras. Blah, blah, blah. It pisses me off. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, nothing I can do. Uh, contact us. I really want to break it. I guess I gotta leave it alone. How do I get it then? Do I have to walk up these fucking stairs? Yes. <laughs> How the hell do I do that? Hmm. I really. I, I oh, actually, this is a serious question. No, this is a real question. Okay, no, you just click the yeah, monokuma. Yeah, you just fucking click it. Oh, okay. You it's told just... me it wasn't interactable. Well, just it wouldn't bring up one of those icons. Oh, okay. Yeah, sorry. <gasps> yes. Good job. <laughs> Oh no, it was nice. That's what it was. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> okay. I've also left you some model coins. I'm so generous. These coins can be exchanged for fabulous items at the beach and the rocket punch market. I've also hidden the stuffed animals in other places too. So do your best and look for them. If you find them all, surprise, surprise. Who kills me last? He kills you. Well, what? Never mind. <sighs> I should just go. So, the so there are. In some, basically, there are five per chapter. Uh, you can find three outside of investigations and two specifically during investigations. Ah! <laughs> uh, uh, oh, I can't remember what his voice sounded like. Shit. Shit, I'm gonna forget this like in between recordings all the time. Oh, it's just you. Don't scare me like that. Uh, I could say the same for you. But by the way, did you see them? Oh man, not good. What the hell are they? Definitely not good. What are you talking about? The bridge, you know. Remember that bridge at the Central Island? Did something happen to it? No shit, why the hell else would I be here? Th those monsters are in front of the bridges. They're, they're blocking them off. They're not monsters, they're mana beasts. Yeah, not monsters, my fucking ass. Oh my god, it's here! <laughs> So the guardians of Jabberwock Island. They're making sure you guys don't go about ignoring the progression by going to the other islands. I'm gonna find a way to clip through them. Come on. <laughs> Those monsters are his gatekeepers. It's better if I don't get close to them. Oh, it's so annoying. I can't stand this anymore. Hey, hey get a grip. Your face is getting egg. egg. <laughs> I can't. There's no way I can get a grip. We're gonna get eaten by monsters. There's no way I can enjoy vacationing here now. Hey, what's with all the noise? Ah, <laughs> another monster. You have, are you okay? And I came all the way here to get you both, but if you're gonna call me a fucking monster. Eh, you're here to get us. I was told to come get you because we kept waiting and you two never showed up. As Why is my head square changing colors. Just to show you it's yours. It's yours. Thanks. 
Everyone is waiting at the hotel restaurant. Hurry up and join us. Or maybe it means you have mail. Everyone's waiting at the you restaurant. Oh, uh, whatever, man. I don't care. I don't care at all. I'm out of here. He's dead first. Hey, where are you going? That's when I. That's what I tried to say. But Kazuichi sprinted away like lightning. He's like. I guess I'll head over to the restaurant. Let's go. So we're gonna find him dead. I'm predicting. To the restaurant. To, to the hotel. Mariah. The hotel. Motel. Hotel lobby. It's not, it's not a motel, it's a hotel. The much higher. Hotel, much higher qual. Hotel Holiday Inn. Hey, what's up? Hotel. Huh? I thought everyone was waiting at the restaurant. Hmm. I thought I'd get some gaming in until everyone else arrived. But I guess I should get going too. Playing video games all morning. Huh. She truly is the ultimate gamer. Basically all three of us. <laughs> <laughs> I had time, so fuck it. Yeah, fuck it. <laughs> You're late, Hajime. And where's Kazuichi? I thought you were together. He, he ran off somewhere. Huh? Where? <laughs> oh, shit. Ah! Sleep. Well, he probably... Er, pro prob what the fuck? How are you having well, a stroke? Well, he pretty much said he was <laughs> running away, but... <laughs> There's nowhere to to run anyway. What a weirdo. However, after what we witnessed yesterday, his behavior is understandable. <laughs> what do you mean? Did something happen yesterday? I don't remember anything happening, and even if I did, it looked totally fake anyway. <laughs> yep, yep, not worth remembering at all. It'd be a lot easier to deal with this if we could just deny it outright like that. So, why have you gathered us here? Not yet, not until Kazuichi arrives. Uh, wait a sec. That means the reason you told us to come here is... We! Apparently Monsieur Biakia has something to tell us! Sorry. It's we. I said we. You said ooey. I did? Whoops, yeah. I meant we. Fucking we. <laughs> I didn't mean... Honestly, that was just that was just me, like, <laughs> revving up my voice. I'm so sorry. <laughs> uh, really? What? Obviously, we're here to discuss our strategy for defeating that monster. There's no way we can find that thing. I mean... It has heavy weapons and everything! If it had light weapons, though, <laughs> shit, it'd be easy to take down. Anything is possible with a fighting spirit! Aw, oh, shit. Oh, yeah, what, yeah. Wait, wait, what it the was hell Riku. was his voice? It was the Riku yeah, it was, thing. it was, well, it's just a little bit more than that, so it's like a bold boast. However, let me give you some advice. <laughs> <laughs> the truly strong do not raise their voice so recklessly. Hey, hey, let's start talking already. <laughs> this is probably some lame attempt to make us feel better or something. Don't make me repeat myself. When everyone is here, then we can start talking. Ah, oh, jeez. Fine. I'll just bring Kazuichi myself, then. Everyone wait here. I'll find him and bring him here, even if I have to tie him up. Mmm, I'm a little jealous now. Getting tied up by Miss Mahiru. Maybe I should run away, too. <laughs> just kidding! <laughs> Disgusting, moron. Now then, let's have breakfast while we wait for everyone. Well, let's eat. Yeah, you would want to. <laughs> the moment he said that, he started wolfing down the pile of food in front of him. Um, where did that food come from, anyway? When I arrived this morning, he was already here. <laughs> they even have crab and shrimp. It's delicious. Crab and shrimp are such a pain to eat. I hate them as much as I hate Mikan's ugly, stuttering face. That's it! That's the face right there! <laughs> Why? Why are you being so mean? Like bullying me. <laughs> You're the kind of girl that bullies just love to torment, aren't you? You should stop now. Ah! I got it! Taro Taro prepared this food, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, un or was like, mm-hmm. Unfortunately, it wasn't me. You see, the food I make doesn't taste as shitty as this does. This is bad. Tastes yummy to me. Just yummy, right? Compared to the world-class dishes I make, a dish that tastes yummy would still be considered shit. In fact, even comparing them is out of the question. Comparing my dishes to this lonely peasant food? How rude! <laughs> I think I'm getting that voice down. Yeah, I like his voice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, hey, don't take it so personally. <laughs> I'm just saying, if you guys ate my food, you wouldn't be able to control yourself. What does that mean? Well, let's just say your jaw wouldn't be the only thing that drops. In fact, your panties would drop, too, like the black thong Miss Pekka was wearing, for example. You creep! How do you know about that? 
he guessed correctly. However, if Terrasaro did not prepare this food, then the one who did is... Could it have been Monokuma? Is it safe to eat food cooked by something like that? That's why I'm tasting it for poison, to make sure it's safe for consumption. But you don't need to eat that much to check it for poison. <laughs> okay, thanks for waiting. I brought him. He's dead? Hey, straighten up a little more. Shouldn't a man like you be embarrassed to walk like that? Stop. Don't pull. You're gonna rip my sleeves. <laughs> yeah, even though you look all flashy, you're actually a big coward. Are you gonna be okay? People like you are usually the first victim, you know. I, I just want to go home already. <laughs> Crash, clatter, boom. Ah! Uh, what the? Oh. All right. Uh, no, 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 no! I tripped! What the f- why? Yeah, what is this, the, like, uh, ass thing? She's the, uh, fan service of this game. Can you even call that tripping? How in the world did you end up in such a compromising position after tripping? <laughs> I like the MZ one on that. <laughs> 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 Wait, who's Terror Terror again? That's you. you. Oh, yeah. Right. Well, it certainly makes me happy. I'm very happy right now. No, I'm so embarrassed. Please help me. His voice is starting to remind me of some other character, and I can't remember what it is off the top of my head. Uh, it's I'll not figure Hifumi, it out, right? No, it's not Hifumi. It's I, another character. I can't remember. Oh, it's just fucking Stewie. From Family Guy. <laughs> oh my god, you're right! Oh, Biakia? Holy shit! No, no, uh, Teru Teru. Yeah. Oh! That is kind of what I'm doing, huh? A little bit. Huh? She looks so adorable when she's embarrassed! It's so moy! I'm practically snorting with joy! <laughs> <laughs> we should help her up. <coughs> well, that was completely unnecessary. Come <laughs> are you okay? Yeah. She's like, oops! <laughs> oops! Your head's definitely not okay. She's beyond being just a clumsy girl. That fall, that fall of hers was like a magic <laughs> trick or something. What? <laughs> anyway, everybody's here now, right? Then let's get going. Since I'm getting sleepy. And Drew, how much fucking mucus do you have in your goddamn <laughs> system, girl? It's mucus. That's everything that's in it. <laughs> You're right. Though I'm not quite ready to stop eating breakfast. I shouldn't begin my talk. So, it's finally starting. That took way too long. They gotta pick up. Cut. Why does he First, spin around? I have a question for you all. That Monokuma thing ordered us to kill each other. So under these strange circumstances, what do you think we need right now? Juice! Who the fuck knows? Get to the point already. If you want me to get to the point, you better hurry up and answer my question. What do we need? We need food and sleep, obviously, right? No, you've forgotten about shitting. Which means the answers are a good appetite, a good night's sleep, and a good shit. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking love Does that guy. Does anyone have a real answer? <laughs> Fucking love that guy. Could it be a Bond? A James Bond? Goddamn. Bond? This is what I believe. As long as the Ultimates work together, there's nothing we can't accomplish. You'll all be able to create a hope that can overcome any despair. Oh, the tiny dancing girl killed someone already. <laughs> 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 That's why, if we want to escape this island, we need to promise each other that we'll work together. It's just, it's just, what is, uh, what's the, what's the mechanic's name again? Uh, Soda. Kazuichi Soda. Uh, Kazuichi. So he's just, like, in the corner, and she's just like, eh, eh. Stabbing <laughs> him repeatedly. Squish the Mr. Yeah, yeah. Squish the Mr. And then, and then they're just like, yeah, they're like, as long as the ultimates stick together, I believe- What? What? How, what are you doing? <laughs> I Stop. already killed him! Stop! <laughs> Stop! It's like, you're just crazy. <laughs> wow, he said that with a straight face? How is he not embarrassed? Oh, shit, she's <laughs> just as I figured, that was kind of lame, huh? However, he does have a point. That must be why Monokuma is enforcing a rule that will cause us to be suspicious of each other. I see. That was a pretty good answer. Since it's impossible to face our enemies as individuals under this circumstances, we must fight as a group. So all of you guys should form a group and I'm gonna be an asshole again. <laughs> However, what we need to achieve that solidarity is not something as easygoing and optimistic as a bond. We need to form a workers' union. <laughs> then what? 
What we need right now is a disciplined leadership, provided by an unmistakable leader. I see. Even sports teams need captains, after all. Rejoice. I shall Fuck accept the position. You. Huh? Now then, I'll wrap up this introduction and let's move on to the main question. Wait just a second. What is it? What did you just say? I don't care how you excuse it. You're being too forceful. Deciding to be the leader all on your own? And why does it have to be you, anyway? Who is more fit to lead other than me? I am the ultimate affluent progeny of the Togami household, destined to stand above all others. S seriously I'm telling you, that attitude of yours is too forceful! <laughs> Mahiru, please wait. It's true that Byakuya may be a little forceful, but given our current circumstance... I believe it is a leader's duty, under circumstances like this, to be forceful to a certain degree. That may be true, but if we just need someone who can lead people, then even Sonya can... No, perish the thought. I am merely a figurehead. Well, he must have the qualities of a leader if he can accept the role under these circumstances. If everyone's okay with it, I'm okay with it too. Then, I guess we've made our decision. Wait, why wouldn't it be the, the team manager guy? Don't he worry, as long shit. as I'm the leader, <laughs> I won't let anyone become a victim. Except for you. I will guide <laughs> you Except all. Except for you. <laughs> that much, I promise. God damn. Yeah! So reliable! It's true he's reliable, but he's kind of an asshole. <laughs> no, mm -hmm. I'm a little surprised. I didn't think he was the type of guy who'd say something like that. I expected the uh, ultimate affluent progeny to look down on us like we're bugs or something. Now then, let's move on to the topic at hand, for real this time. I have something to show you all. Something to show us? It's at Jabberwock Park at the Central Island. Come, follow me! After saying it so bluntly, Byakuya turned and left the restaurant, stomping his feet along the way. Just, just as I thought. He sure is forceful. Geez, we may have made a mistake in choosing him as a leader. Though everyone made similar co uh, complaints, they all followed Byakuya out of the restaurant. So, next time on Root Beer Gamers, next maybe we'll follow him too. I guess I guess we will next time on Root Beer Gamers. Next time. See you guys next time. Bye.